Welcome, welcome, welcome to Space Age Factorio. Um, five hours in, I've just got my first train set up, and I am going. Oh, screen shot. Um, place is tiny. I am going to get oil going, and then I'll work on red chips and blue science. I got, I got, I got three sciences: red, green, and military. Um. The resource, that, that iron is so far away. I've seen quite a few other people's plays and that way further away than other people's. I don't understand, but most of the seed I picked. Um, it's a lot of trees in my seed, which is good, but it's a lot of effort to build this train line to go right through this forest. Manually chopping all those trees down was a bit of effort. Um, I was going to check down that oil I had here, but it'll be fine. Also, we started getting um, other seed machines finally. I was probably getting a uh, solar panel was crafted at the bottom of this belt. I think gap here as well. And uh... Oh, we don't have batteries. Definitely can't do that. I'll leave it there just to remind me that I don't have it. But um... Yeah, the, the copper and... Oh, I should have ran out of belts, didn't we? I'm really glad I put these little um, belts around. Quite useful. Okay, I need. Dump, 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 dump. I think I need 800, but. Eh, maybe it's okay. Power poles, okay. Oh, you've got the bigger poles now. Put power line all the way down to the iron iron mine. Uh, oh, yeah, seventeen, nice. Um, I could do, I could do gas power from this oil to this and power there. So much biters nearby though. It's, um, it's very far. Very far. Oh, it's only fourteen. Yeah, it's not so great. What about this one? We've got 66. It's not bad. I think 66 probably should be our power line that. We'll do it inside the train. I think it'll be fine. Steel's got better because it's all kind of buffered up now. Um, I probably can go split here actually. I don't really need to, but I feel like I can. So, ah, oh, not there. Ah. Uh, Hmm. Actually, I changed my mind. I'd rather... Yeah. Just so I got a space for the cars to drive through. Um, green chips and... Uh, thing. And this is steel. I said a bit shit, but surprisingly that actually fits there. Um, there we go, we got solar panels, so might come in handy. Might actually use them. And we'll make uh, 200. It's pretty much the end of the line, that one. So it's just going to gobble stuff up. Maybe even worth doing quality. I don't even know how quality does to that sort of item, but I suspect it would make them generate more power. Oh, I went to my cogs. I have to buff the cog production anyway. It's been, and these ones just should be should be on um. I thought it was a long time ago, but I never really uh, craft, I never automated that. Can I put it in here? Still can, I'm just going to copy this out and we put it back down like the old school way, which is like this. So does that fit? I can if I move 
Uh, oh, next switch over and use uh Yeah, I can do that. Okay. I don't have overflow though. Hmm. Let's go to chest for this. That'll do. Let's pick all this shit up. It's the sort of thing you do with bots, but I don't have bots. Why is that no power? Alright, that's been moved. Let me just put the one here. And this is now a bonus set is. Apparently put a belt on these tiles helps. And then we can get the green chips. Oh, we'll just need a buffer for them. Um I think I think fifty's fine. And we can make these a bit quicker. I don't know what what's the speed? Is the oh it's the set is between I think. And plus we can upgrade them to be nicer. Been on a fair. Oh, yeah, it seems to be alright. Just saying for the, the um, cogs. I don't know that inserted speed is fast enough, but I think not. Uh, chips are a curse of factory, right? You need an endless supply of them almost all the time, especially once the blue ones come in. Hey Clarado, yeah, I agree. I agree. We're okay though for now. It should that green chip. We just kind of double the production rate of green and cogs, so should do a bit better. And go um power my new train line. Oh, where's the train? It's, oh, it's down the arena, isn't it? Now uh, come back for me. I should use blue inserters there as well, and I probably should have picked up iron chests, but... Oh, this is not even right. I forgot this. It's got no, uh... <laughs> it doesn't even have the chests at this end. Oh my god. Um... Manual. Yeah, this is no good. Damn, man, I didn't even notice. I think we're just doing internally. That's what I normally do. This is dumb. Um, yeah. All right. Uh, yeah, it's enough chess. There you go, Clarado. And uh, good morning. Having a good morning. Alright, I'm probably going to copy this bit. That's not too busted. And then, um... I'm gonna do it. Do I southern? I think I southern. southern. Very extra tile.
Just two belt. That's probably fine for now. It's so day at work where nothing happens, so yeah, nice morning. Just a bit cold for my liking. And then it's the middle of October. I guess it gets it gets a bit colder and by December, January. What's the coldest month for you, eh? I mean the coldest I think is uh, June, July here, but Okay, it's like a dry cold, then it gets a wet wet cold in like September, but then it starts getting warm. Okay, yeah, so this one here is fine. That one's gonna plug into there, isn't it? But it's a bit of a mess. A little different down there where you are from. Yeah. It's island weather as well, so um, it changes quite quickly. Like continental weather is like, you probably get like weeks at a time of similar sort of weather. But it's definitely not that here. You might get half a day of the same weather. <laughs> Uh, Alright, let's go. We want to do power pot. Oh. Where do we start the power pot from? Go from here, it's fine actually. Get automatic. There we go. I'm gonna stay near the sea, so our autumns are all wet and nasty. Really windy, and the wind is humid. Oh. Sounds almost like where I am. We get like a very um, minus five C uh, wind from the south, from the Antarctica. And uh, yeah, winter's like zero degrees to five degrees but of course the wind chill goes negative five but on that so where's the wind chill that's the big problem the actual damage is not bad We don't get winters, that's the funny part. It's like an extended autumn. Oh, okay. Interesting. Interesting. Minus two and no snow. Oh yeah, we don't, we don't get snow here either. What are the pollution's like from this thing? Looks fine. What the power cost of it, right? How many miners is that? Yeah, it's like five megawatts from this mine. Um, but it should be enough to get my iron ore okay for a while. I need to get uh, the oil over there hooked in. Before I get to here, so it's another train line. I go. Hmm, it's a bit tricky. There's so many trees. I have to wiggle through. I could do a diagonal one. I don't like diagonal trains though. But I could diagonal to here. I don't get that any better. Seems to be okay. I prefer some efficiency modules though. Ah, oh, probably put a radar there actually. Good idea. I need to automate landmines and stuff as well, because all the military assets for attacking the biters. Made a 
rail angling much more flexible from what I read. Feel that by now or not really? Um, I found it really weird to do the initial rail track actually, yeah. But I couldn't judge the distance. Because it's all different. I mean, it's probably fine, but it's, yeah, I just found it hard to judge the distance. I'm sure when I put the next train track down, but uh, when you put it down, you used to like do a block of like one train when you put it down, but now it just kind of just keeps on going. I can't, I couldn't really judge. Like this is already way too big of <laughs> a turn. Um, there's enough for another carriage here, so it's too long. But um, I don't have a standard rails or anything. I was driving here for something. Oh yeah, I was gonna check the um. I'm gonna check that one. I could power it again, I guess. Do I have a chem plant? So I could do a oil refinery and a chem plant down there. And have it power itself. Car definitely feels smoother though. This is how I get the unlock the um oil. You gotta do like you gotta mine enough oil to unlock the science. Got to set up a tiny little uh, power plant just for one oil derrick. <clears throat> um, but I was planning doing um a gas a gas one. And uh, a chem plant to make solid fuel. And they can power itself. Ah, uh, oh, it's in here, isn't it? It does need to be this close, but oh my god, I keep forgetting about the new thing. You gotta push E. I don't know the keyboard commands. The car driving definitely feels smoother. 100%. 100% that. Okay, so... I'll give it a little bit of coal. It should kickstart this. Oh, I need another one. There we go, we've got a little little factory here just to uh, make sort of fuel to burn in the factory to keep it going. <laughs> All it does is, is, is keeps the, um, the radar going. Um, but I could do it to power this whole uh, crude oil factory. I can make a crude oil factory on here that powers itself. I don't have to have it um, draw my main power grid if I wanted to. I, I'll just connect it up. It doesn't really matter. So I just want to kind of curious. This only makes this does make 900 kilowatts, and this power area needs. Well, I do need two of them. Yeah, the, um, the oil. I had to mine this oil. That's why I set up this little power plant, because this is a science unlock. You can't just research to get this, you have to actually mine with this, so this, this, this tiny little setup. And it worked out quite well. I researched it pretty quickly. It was pretty good actually, we ended up getting 20,000 oil in this uh, storage tank before this ran out of coal. Well now it well, goes on this sort of fuel. This thing just barely does anything as well. Why don't Ben sort of feel cleaner? What's the dirt on this thing? It says... Uh... It says 12 megajoules fuel value. What's the dirt value on burning it? 
It's three times the um, your density. I guess it's better. Gravity greater than 0.1 meters a second. Interesting. Pressure greater than 10 he hectopascals. Huh? Different uh, conditions. But yeah, I need to get this oil going. I, I was going to get the oil here, but maybe this oil here I can get going instead and then plug it into this train track and have it join up. It probably makes more sense. I mean, that one's easy to hook on, but this is a bigger patch. It's just that I want to get the... I'm going to piss off these butters, I think. Plus, there's a lot of... trees in the way. Not too bad though. Might be for a surprise, yeah. Probably. Such is life, you know? A lot of surprises. Oh, I don't have any uh, pipes with me actually. Bit of a miscalculation on that. Let me throw trees. <coughs> um. Interesting. Quite tricky there with the trees. doesn't work either. Now let me go put a Efficiency modules down when I have these sort of thing, but I haven't got red chips yet. I'll have to get that when I get it. Because these are really massive polluters. Like... 10 a minute each one, so they're really hard out polluters. Might be enough getting that to start with. We've still got we can hook the rest of them in, but um <coughs> I don't think we need them going. We now pipes. Yeah, there's like a little little plop of it looks like warm liquid or something. That's quite nice. The pipe thing is quite nice as well, being the um, visual. But you can see the little tar pond with the steam coming off it. Or polluted steam, whatever.
Is there anyone left? We got one there, and then one in the water. More than enough oil for this one thing. No, it is, it's not even going to the tank yet. I haven't actually hooked it in. Oh. I hope the pipe thing will help with avoiding mixing fluids. Ha, huh, what a nightmare it was to manage my first space, space and EC. All the thermo fluids, oh my god. Yeah, the... I, I was playing that and I updated my game and they... Just if they they made it so they cross contaminate, but they didn't before. And it took me ages to figure out like all the connections where they're accidentally uh, bordering on the the buildings. It was a bit rough. Yeah, they just got a big pollution cloud for this thing. Um, almost needs look, needs look more power too. Surprisingly, this thing's filled up though pretty quick. We actually got heaps of um Maybe make a little tank for gas here even. Maybe another power plant thing going. Pretty much problem for that, but Here we go. Nice little base. The base is overloaded and very messy. Yeah, my base is always messy. Yeah, I think like the the way to way to to, to uh, explain it to me is how much of a bit of paper do you use when you draw on a bit of paper? I would take up a small corner and not use the whole page. I'm like afraid of using all the available real estate I've got available. I'm like, okay, I, I can use this bit first because I might need the rest of it. Whereas other people are more expansive, they'll use the whole page and do massive big broad strokes. Um, and I think that comes through into base design as well. Um, if you take up small base space in a little paper, you probably want to build a small base and try to make it very uh, as crammed together as possible. It's looking pretty good for this sort of fuel. Uh, I think that's a good little base. The pollution's going to be fine for a bit. I think that what will happen though is I'll probably build a nest and then destroy this whole thing. So what I'll do is I'll leave some turrets. I don't know where, but I think this is the more important place. Yeah, we've got like 50 ammo each. Two turrets. I mean, if they attack this, yeah. If they attack these, um, so be it. I mean... Well, maybe I shouldn't be so callous. Maybe I should give them some sort of chance. Uh, normally I'd give them defenses, but I got I got nothing. There we go. Got sight defending it. But I was also very fanatic about saving as much of low density structures because my land base was also very cramped. That's when I also learned that you just cannot live like that in Factorio. Yeah, I think Factorio actually expands your uh, personality, to be, to be honest. You slowly learn to be more expansive. It takes, it takes a lot of uh, uh, like unlearning. It's like unlearning a brain trauma of limited space. I know it's a trauma or not even. Like maybe it's a positive thing, like in a scarce environment you do really well. But in an abundant society you, you don't do so well, you know what I mean? Like, you won't take advantage of all the things that reality has to offer but then maybe it's a good thing for society as a whole so that convex we save as much as possible yeah I'm a endless saver rainy day <laughs> rainy days 
Um, oh, I actually need a train line. I need a bypass for my current train. I think it's okay, this setup. But <clears throat> we need to join in. I don't get past this. This is, this is bad because there's cliffs in the way. Oh, I'll get through here, I guess. We do a train line through there. That's a bit. Oof. Where's the gap? Looks like it's the gap there. This is the train. I'd say that you can see the. You can see this, the movement here. Like It's quite a lot of steps you can do. No, nah, I don't think I. Th I think you can't actually. I'm an idiot. Can't. Oh no, I don't have the um. I don't have the um raised rails or whatever. Yeah. I don't even know what tech that's under. But I imagine that's un that's an unlock, right? You can build the ones on stilts or whatever. But I I, I don't got that. Um, pre-stilt. Uh, not quite. Wait, yeah, can you get there? No. Alright, All right, I have to start from this end to get off the thing properly. We just go straight down, actually, like that. Yeah, Man, it's hard to make it cross over, actually. It's doesn't. Is that it? I think so. It looks weird. That that. Does not look right. <laughs> that looks weird. It looks like a, a real weird kink on the track. Um, I don't want to put things around these things. What I do normally is do a bypass. So I don't know whether it's my utility is train tracks or not. I don't have much to my utility. These are the only things I've really thought I'd use in other games. Very minimal. I don't have any train stuff. So in general. Um Yeah. Do I have any train stuff? I don't think I can just rebuild a bypass. It feels so wrong, yeah. This, 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 my brain just looks wrong here. This doesn't look right. This piece here, or this piece here, looks like it's not connected. It looks like it's, it's like it got a kink in it. It's like a bent, a bent track. I don't trust the train's gonna go on it. I'm like, <laughs> um, let's have a look. <laughs> I don't trust it. Yeah, it works. Okay. This looks wrong. Jeez, it, this looks, looks like way too natural as well. Oh my god. What the hell, man? Works or works, yeah. Oh, that's cool. I like it. It's just, um, it takes a bit of, like, like, huh? <laughs> really? The new law of the land. Law of flexible tracks. And the worst thing is I got like, I buy like a, um, why well, don't buy, I feel like a, a writing pad. I got lots of them and I never use them because I'm like, oh, uh, <laughs> I just can't use them. Like, <laughs> I really should use them. A lot of writing pads. All right, let's get a nice little track and then loop it back. Uh, I don't really care about, to be honest, is it? 
This is such a shitty train station, though. Holy moly. What have we done? It just feels so wrong. Can we, can we even loop it? I mean, maybe. Wow, it does. It's like a, it's like a oblong. Actually, that's, that's rude. I uh, still wonder what is the tech for the elevated ones and such. Yeah, it'd be in, uh, try elevated. So it looks like it's production science. And it's not far away, actually. I just need blue science and purple science unlocked. And I get it. And I can have raised ramp. Ra rail ramp? Rail support. And the rail planner will consider it. Not too far. Alright, I guess we build a train here with the um they put some <sighs> entry exit signals. Red red, yeah that's fine. And then we're gonna have a this good I'll give the fuel it here actually. Uh... Oh wait, we're gonna have to fuel this with the oil here, aren't we? Oh, the oil is way slower now too. That's right. They changed the fl fluid speed, so I wonder how that's gonna work. I actually didn't automate pumps. Oh, lucky I I've got steel in my pocket and I got engines in my pocket, so I'm glad I kept the foresight to keep those two items around because they are very useful for these sort of situations. Um, oh, maybe red on these ones. And with one pump going in. I still think it's worth doing pumps. Is this the. Different ca use case now, I think. Not everywhere to make up for game mechanics. No, targeted. I need two of those. Oh, I'm an idiot. What are you doing? Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh my god. We're supposed to be pumping oil. What are we doing? Probably the wrong thing. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Alright. Uh yeah. I think it's pumped it out. There's like basically nothing left. I have to unplug that. And then undelete it, and that's fine. Probably me. There we go. The first corridor. What's the speed? It's going a thousand a second out of twelve hundred. So that's fine. And that's already at max at twelve hundred. Alright, that's fine. Let's drain the shit out of this though. I think we need more of our storage. Lucky me though, I brought a bunch of storage tanks. That should do. The pollution cloud's quite impressive actually. Really impressive. Let me move my chat back on. Docs. Chat. And if from 12k to 1.2k. Yeah, I think it's fine. I mean, we're getting 2400 a second. And they buffed the size of this by 100% on the wagon. 
So I'm not sure how much oil we want to move per trip, but that, uh, that seems like a lot. There we go. A second time power plant. We can always come back here and make it more efficient. Uh, once we get some green stuff going. Now we need to, uh, we need a bypass now that this train's stuck right now because of my silliness. Better fix that up. Make the station proper name. BTAMO, what the hell sort of name is that? Um, oh, can't read. Uh, oil. P. Um, load count. Same. Well, I can have, you can have. What? You can have oil that's higher grade? I guess so. Um, grade and equal to 45,000, that's fine. Uh, connectivity. Ooh. Missed my car. All right. Could go to sort of few actually. We need is one bypass uh, before the turn off. Oh, it's okay. I actually checked the logic out on the transient. Oh, this bypass might be a bit funny. It's not straight here. I'm gonna do a. This is so wonky. Look how wonky this is. Oh my god. What am I done? I might have to bypass after, but it's gonna be on the straight there in the forest. Right, I think the right hand side makes sense. Yeah, I know real life train rails are weird, but what I mean by weird is that it's not because it's not standardized. It makes it hard for me to make a blueprint for it. So I have to find a straight bit now and make a blueprint. We got more real estate, yeah. Alright, let's do a minimal turn. Go straight. I'm gonna go straight. I don't want to chop down all the forest. We only need a, I want a three link train to better bypass, not the like, massive train. <coughs> I think that is more than enough. We'll just turn it back in. Alright, let's use my signals, so go uh, yep. No, it's that one. Well, I'll go way back there even. And this one is... Well, I could go there even at the turn, but... I think it's safer to do that. It's my shitty, uh, blueprint. Uh... Bypass this! 
I might want some Christmas lights. These are lights. I don't even know where the what are they called even? Yeah, the signals, eh? Alright, that should be fine. And that should be actually the track. What we're gonna do now is this run out of fuel. Hey, cannot find path. Really? No. Oh, I did I didn't do it right at all. It's the other side. Oops. Twenty plus trains will not block each other. Oh man, I can't I can't I can't do twenty lip trains. What are you talking about? <laughs> What's this doing in their train business? Uh, oh, actually, I'll just update the, the one I'm doing, what's this wrong? New content. Hey, Valdek, welcome back. How you going, buddy? Is it, are you sure it's Friday? Are you sure? So we got a, uh, my iron ore train is doing alright. I do need to give it some uh, more juice. We have to fight off these bad guys over here soon, I think. I'll do some fighting. I had my shirt on for the last 15 minutes while working. As opposed to being shirtless. Top, is, this, is it topless day in the office, Feldak? Is that way in? I'm not sure uh, HR's approved that topless day in the office. I mean, it's equality, but... I think society gets offended by that. I think we're going to put the oil over here. This one's actually decent, round little... Bussy, I might go and... Uh, I had a call of customers, so I put on my shirt and turn on camera. Ah. Rude. Like a real person. Alright, let's go copy this. This is not bad. It's not good though. Uh, I don't like any of this train setup. Is, is, is this terrible? This is no good at all. I don't know what I was thinking. I gotta get rid of it. It's, it's terrible. Alright. I'll leave that bit there because we're not going to use it. We're going to put oil on this one. Um, I think the rest of it looks okay. I'll get rid of the, that one too. Uh, unload. Train. So your costume for a costume party will be shirtless. I see. <laughs> Hey, maybe. Uh, June underscore underscore okay. rated your channel with 16 viewers. Hey, June. Welcome, welcome. After a shout out for you, buddy. Shout out at June. How's it going? How's your, uh, How's the fighting? Now the baddies. Actually, I can't research anything right now. That's about to start oils. I just got my oil going. I was about to get oil train into here. I might get you kind of put it back here a bit more. Um, um, fighting is such a pain without mods. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, true that. I think it's fine. This Maholic streamer seems good. Um, common, rare, even. Hey, Red Rove. 
How's it going, buddy? Yeah, I, I think fighting's uh, quite... It's still the same, though. You just dump down, uh, dump down some Gamba turrets, right? And you, away you go laughing. Okay, that... This train track's like disappeared inside the grass. Did they not put medium rare in there? Well, I mean, medium rare steak isn't too bad. I mean, let's, let's be real here. Quite juicy. But is, is there some offensive term about medium rare, is there? But I don't know. I wouldn't know. I'm, I'm innocent. There we go. That's nice. Well, when your turrets die with 50 ammo on them and all the ammo goes poof, it's just bad programming. Ah, oh, the ammo goes poof. I see. Yeah, that's not, that's not, that's not very, uh, fortunate. Um, not good at all. I don't think we need, uh, the belt stuff in this one. We can get rid of all that. We do need the oil. Oh yeah, I've only got, oh, I can only afford one pump. I'm poor. I need one pump. And this is going to be, uh, this is going to be a June station. Uh, June underscore underscore dash oil D. Right. I need I need to put that train to come here actually. I guess I'm I'm a bit fiddly when it comes to fighting, so I kind of like hand fumble. I have to, I got these two here, and that's the best I got. Making these a uh, on the hot bar one and two, and I can actually just go boop boop. And it seems to help me out, but I want to get to the landmines. I've got them researched. We actually got flame for our ready to go as well and defender capsules um but i'm also, I'm trying to get i'm trying to get red ships first can i get this train come uh was it fluid count of oil is less than or equal to zero and inactivity go I just send my hot bar. I'm not. I'm the oily, oh, oh, honk, honk. Yeah, yeah. You're you're the oily boy, man. Big, big oil. Sponsored by. Sponsored by June. Big oil. There we go. Look how fast that little train is. Yes, yeah, so this one here is there's two tanks. That's the full whole thing. It's interesting. I might have to go fight uh, these guys over here. I think. I don't want to get landmines because they're so much better fighting. So I might get automate them. But I was supposed to get plastic and stuff here. I need to get uh, a whole bunch of stuff for that. What's landmines for automating anyway? Explosives, which is sulfur, which is gas. Okay. Okay, we can do all that. I do like the new rails though, even though they're very unique. Very unique. And I still only got, I only got, um, I got non armor piercing rounds as well. I'm not sure it's going to be tough enough for this, these, these biters out here. Oh, there are these guys are little guys. They should be alright.
Helps turn the bullet upgrades. Jeez, that's way quicker than the um, previous nest I took on. But yeah, the forests are pretty cool. So when you get like this sort of... Oh, can we stuffed up there? And then babies down here. No, near my car alone. No. <laughs> Why are you running away, man? It's so rude. They sh they should have they should have lost focus on the um. Whoa. Calm down. Tough guys, eh? Alright, that's good. There's one up there and one there. I might get rid of both of them as well. Um, I don't need to, but... Oh, my car's a bit... I'm gonna... No, I think they're going up here to make a nest or something. I saw them running up here. I don't know whether that's because I, I woke them up. But they're walking around here. What are they doing? That's their new home. Maybe it's Papa Bear. That's my turrets anyway. We got some non damaged turrets. We got how many bullets we got? I think 100. Big old bullets left. first. That forest there looks epic. Dude, how to get through there? Turns out easily. A bunch of worms in this peninsula. Interesting. Okay. Are to drive back down? Maybe not. No, I think I should go and um there's one more nest. Area. Not too bad. Yeah, oh, what's the best attack? I don't like taking from the south for some reason. This is this one might be a bit more piecemeal. I need more ammo. I think I'm a bit rough on 163 rounds. Um, my only thing I can do with it almost no ammo. No, 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 no. no. We can pick up these guys. They've got all the ammo. <laughs> There's like a hundred rounds in the first two. They kind of stuffed the other ones from shooting. All right, I think we're good. Got a nice clean uh, slate there. Um, this is going to be a problem when this expands, though. I think my home base, like, I only got these three up here, and then this one here. And then we got heaps of territory. Uh, without biters at all. Home for days. I'm gonna first focus on building. 
I think I can build for a while now. I've got the oil I need for the red chips. I need to get a plastic factory going. I can pick up some chem plants first. I had to have a power line, didn't I? Another power line. I put a little road though, so I can drive through here now, which is nice. Alright, where's my chem plants? Those are definitely, uh, can I get rid of the shit ones now? Got the nice ones. Wow, I've got 200 solar panels! They, they actually maxed out and that while I got away. That's amazing. I mean, I just, I just like, I just sort of cheekily build them. I mean, it's not that much, but each one's 60 kilowatts, so that's like 12 megawatts, right? That's like my entire power grid right now. On daytime, I can run on that. I think my site, my factory's kind of stopped though. I might bump that up then. Uh. We need chem plants, or refineries. I don't think anything else actually. I think it's for. Oh, now I got the tanks ready. Oh, yeah, the um, the on setters. Belts are fine. Pipes, definitely. Underground pipes, definitely. This, I got buff this up. I think we're gonna go to, to, to 150 on that. And this should be on 100. Uh, I need bullets. I could start um, prioritizing excess bullets to be put into a chest rather than military science. So prioritize left. But if you do make some, put them in a chest to me, buddy. Ah, oh, we're in the wrong tab. And this should have no. Well, maybe. I don't know what number that is. I think it's 800. I didn't fully upgrade these to. Oh, they got 2000 military science now. Holy moly. I should start buffering green and red science then, because I'm not doing anything. Um, hmm. How do I do that in this area? We have to move this up a couple of tiles just to do a buffer. Oh. So, ah. Oh. Is that going to work? Think about this for a little sec. So, it inverts it though, it's a problem. Uh, I'll just ignore the fact that there's, there's a thing there, and they'll be fine then. Let's go straight up. One side can take, and the other side takes, and then they just can add them back. I should take away those. It goes through iron chests. There we go. Some sort of buffer, anyway. Some military science. I might buff these up to. Get a bit faster. I think copper's fine for now, but stone is definitely a bit creaky. 
I'm not sure what's even using all the stone. You already have mixed chests. Do I? Oh, I do too. Man, I thought they. Ah, oh, because they. Yeah, okay. Um. So that should be green. Cool. Thanks, uh, Joan. I was a bit oblivious there. Oh, yeah, I want to get the, uh, yeah, okay, let's go get this. I have to put to the south. I need some bricks. I forgot how much of bricks. I want to build to the south of this. Well, it's kind of like actually not. It's like southwest. It's actually quite far the oil, but I can pipe it to the south of this. Uh, for plastic. I don't even know where I'm gonna build the plastic. I think through this forest. So this forest is pretty thick though, eh? Like, what the hell? I'm not gonna destroy this forest. I might just build the plastic here and then figure out a way of building it through. Uh... <laughs> I got so much forest in my starting area. I, I don't want to chop this down because it's such a good pollution absorber. And also because it'll take me forever to chop it down. I mean, I do have grenades, but um... Not the best. Now this area here though, probably could build in here. Yes, yeah, flamethrower. Yeah, I can actually craft that. But I haven't uh, got the ammo. Pretty serious trees though. Pretty serious. Yeah, I got, got, got grenades as well, but they, um... Oh wow, this is actually... Oh, this is an intense amount of fluids. I might send it up instead. We could do oil processing up. Well... Is it gonna, if the copper train's gonna come here and the stone train. They have a coal train. Uh, well... I guess the coal's gonna come into here. So processing wise, I don't know about processing. I could process oil on the other side of this track. There's a big open space here. Which means where I put this is a bit stupid. You need to be by water. Hmm. Why by water? Look at this little water look at this lake here. It's, it's such a weird little lake. So it's very unique. Okay, let's get the pipes going anyway. I feel I should just go straight up, to be honest. And process in here. Destroy these trees here. That's not too bad to build up. I think we got a belt through this area here. Through there. Yeah, we can do that. So we can put it in here and just destroy these trees. No, we don't. I mean, I do need water though, that's for sure. Which is a good pump from here currently. I don't have advanced oil though at this point. I got, um, I need to get the blue science going to unlock that. I just need some, I just need some, uh, blue science. That's what I need. I need red chips, which is plastic. So I could do a basic one, a real basic one here. Mm -mm -mm. 
I could train water actually. I could. Oh. I don't pick up enough uh, pipes again. Oh, here's the big pole. This is going to go through my power quite quickly as well. put them down like down here somewhere. I don't really like building top down, I can only build bottom up. With my um brain method down up. Is that upside down? Maybe like the fracking and stuff here. And then you away from here you'd have like actual factory stuff. So I don't have coal here though do I? Yeah, that's the thing I don't think about. Alright, coal down there. 8, 5, 6k, that's so little. 2 million. 4 million. That might be worth getting, even though it's uh, next to a bite nest. Um, if that's a peninsula, I can, I can just defend that. Destroy that. Train, that's a long train track though. I have to bring the train down to... Kirish anyway. Alright, take care June. Thanks for the raid, as always. Yeah, it's probably on the flip side. More factory to be had, eh? I guess we need sulfur though. In the water, but the water's a pain in the ass. Oh man. There's water here though, it's not actually that far. That's not far. It's closer than that. So could put the can plant these things down here more. Oh, this is kind of where the train depot is. What about more train depots down there? Mm. Not for a long time. I think it's fine where it is. We'll just put a long pipe. It's going to be a bit sad for the initial uh, water. I can run parallel to this train track though. This is where the, we'll test out the new pipe limits and see how they are. I think they're fine. You don't need that much water. Twenty five point nine meters. What does that even mean? Seventy six meters. Pipe extent one thirty one out of three twenty. What does that mean? I don't even know. Oh, where's my car? Did I drop. Where is my car? Huh? Oh, there it is. Awkward. Uh, we could go for...
sulfur. That's basically the, the kicker for um, what I need. I need sulfur, lots of sulfur for, for the, well, not really actually, but I want it for the, um, this thing. That's the sulfur that came on science. Though, maybe I should do sulfur down here. I'm, I'm going to still use this for baking uh, sauric acid, but I have to pipe the plates from up here down to here to do that. But silly, I really just pipe the gas and process up closer to these things. I should just process in here or something. I was a little scared enough for room, but it does make sense to make like sulfur and sauric acid in here. And then you can pipe the sauric acid back to here, because I was going to do a train for the uranium here. I don't even need a train, but I can just pipe it to that. That's just not far. Why did I, why did I even build this thing here? <laughs> um, oh well. If I had the coal here, it would have been fine, but I just totally forgot. It slipped my mind. Now I gotta like build another train station to get the coal. Now I could just grab that 900k. And considering I've already got train tracks down there, I think that's the best bet. I need to put another station. Like that. And that can unload, unload the coal. Grocery rails look really cool, I have to say. Yeah, it's kind of, I find it weird. It's like the, it's almost like they feel like a bit more rustic. Really like submerged in there. Oh, we don't even have. All right. I should actually pick up a whole bunch of proper rails. Uh, not rails, um. Uh, blue inserters at least. They used to be like that, just not that pretty. Oh, okay. I played so much uh, space exploration and Crash Tower 2 that my my vision and memory of uh, the Nutter is quite warped. All my ratios are all like for like mods. All wrong. This print is not actually ideal. It should be in range of this. Oh, it was in range. It just didn't feel like it was in range. Cool. So this is a uh, coal train. No group assigned. Interesting. Zero battler. Uh, empty cargo. Activity. 
Angel Sims. Oh, I'm not sure I've done that one. You could just drive down. We need another bypass in between. Well, three bypasses here. Just for like the fact that we're gonna have these trains coming in and out of a single lane track. I'm real, I'm a big a big enjoyer of one way track, so I never find trains that necessarily have insane number of trains. But maybe you maybe I will find a case for it one day. Maybe this is the mod pack for it. I get my car back though, it's over there. Ugh. So far. I guess, oh, we could always have the train turn the other way too, I guess. We add in multiple uh, resources. The bypass is slightly too long. In between. That's unfortunate. I mean, I could go there. Um, maybe. I think the, the light will bung up though. Can I merge this for a little bit though? But not really. Can you flip them? Oh, I should try that actually. I thought that I heard butters for a second then. Tricky building that. Doesn't like it's like like need a bot to build it. Whoa! I thought it was on the track. Jeez, that was close. <laughs> Reasons, but they wrote that they improved on it, and now you can. Yeah, you might be able to. I mean, how do you flip DNFA? They don't do anything. But they might have changed the keybinds though. I wouldn't know. They connect still. I swear it sounds like biters in the in the trees. Creeps in the trees, man. Speaking me up. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, I guess I go to this coal mine. My coal was up here is one eight one, it's pretty little. Let's go up, um get my car. I think I need a second car. I forgot my first one. We're not doing very very well on my uh, my goal for blue science right now. I mean, I could use the existing coal, but I feel like it's kind of my original base here is just making my science buffers right now. I'm not really doing anything else. Uh, what else do you need to pick up? Um, more blow inserters. 
Why do I have stack instead of. Oh, I need red, red chips. Oh, those buff, those belts look much happier. We can do my a new solar array, I guess. We want to put a solar array like somewhere in the middle of nowhere, right? Like, there's three nests up there now. I might have to wipe them out. I didn't realize it's three. We can definitely depop the, the butters quite well, apparently. We haven't like made too much. Not too big of a menace. Yeah, the the nest um, I think there's quite a lot of utility used early game, but it's um, <coughs> like the shotgun's been buffed up a lot. So a couple shots now to kill a nest with a shotgun. Real strong. Where's this coal patch? Is that it? Mm, pretty sad. Alright, so that is the unload train. I need a pickup train. I guess I can invert that, but... Do I have a proper pickup? Well, it's that one there, I guess, but it's not really done properly. I think the pickup one at least is kind of correct. G goes inside the car? What? I don't think I can invert this. I don't know how to. F and G doesn't do anything. Um, I'd like to invert it. Hoping that uh, cliff's kind of just in the way. Oh, that's perfect. We can go there without compromising the patch or the cliff. A little bit of that. So it's a nice little blueprint. Why can I build that? Oh, it's no train. Yeah, I tried F and J, and neither of them did anything. So I don't know what the key is anymore. I haven't looked it up. I mean, it probably exists. I just don't know what it is. I might have power this from the um the oil power plant. <coughs> Why can I build that there? What's wrong with that tile? Why is it red? Huh? Can I not put it on the coal patch? No way. Oh, if I ran out of these. Oh, okay. 
You know, they ran out of train stations. These. Amateur man, what am I doing? Um, I don't even have those. I have to use wooden chests again. All my train stations are like real, uh, real budget. I mean, it's the same same sort of thing, so it doesn't matter. But not funny. about the other side of that but not the best patch either but um Patches. Really, I didn't even respect it. We're doing um, underground or something. Good. Now do. Not night. Oh. Oh, whatever. Oops. I get the train station going and the power lines. This is gonna get some biter hostility, I think. I think these two nests here will wake up. I have to wipe out both of them. These ones out here should be okay, I think, because there's trees. Well, some trees. I'll go for that nest there, I think, now. Before I activate this um, patch. Do I get bullets? I did not get bullets. That's a bit risky. Uh, 
craft some defender capsules, try them out. Nice and bullets, but Shotgun's really good. Really good. I wonder if damage has been upgraded by. I don't know, I guess it's been upgraded though. That's good in the coast there, Claire, because we do need that copper and that stone as well. Well, probably need that copper. But we do need that stone. And then we have to wipe out that nest, but this is really. This is where I want to clear down to a straight big corridor down because then it's kind of like block off that we can I think wipe all that out and block across here or something but um might be over clearing but I'd rather not have to fight with defenses I'd rather just be proactive with my defense Really? Oh man. Didn't let me get ghost through that for some reason it wasn't. That was the bug. Is that a bug you reckon? Wouldn't let me ghost through the rocks. This is make them impossible or something. Maybe I was doing it wrong. We're running out of track actually. I'm not gonna make it, I don't think. Maybe we'll make it. Yeah, that's fine. Very natural looking though, but cool. These squiggles are growing. No time spent uh, getting resources online. They're so far away. to here but we're actually undercooked by quite a lot this will mine but um it's gonna go very slowly until I get more power oh it's fine the most this kind of shuts off when it's not been used so
So I guess this does need fuel. I could make solid fuel from the gas and do that for this thing. Give a name to it. What's it even called? Oh, we haven't even got a station there, it's fine. That's what the right uh, insert is. Those pipes are quite nice. Never used those pipe mods that appear to whatever ones. That's quite good visualization. Alright, we need to get that train station. I'm missing. And that coal's quite far away from my base actually, which is a little bit annoying, but I need it down there. So where's oh the train station's up here in it? Put on lights anyway. Train stations. Pipes, train light oh yeah. Rails are a bit low on too. Uh oh wagons, just in case. On them. Or train wagons. That poles are fine. Well, I we might want to grab another stack. Got chem plants, eight and four. Uh, yeah. And that's enough to get the um, coal train going. This is looking a bit dire on this stone. Quite surprised how weak the initial base I got for resources is. I have to get this uh, train set up. I mean, I could belt it. I mean, I literally could do a long belt from like here to there, the stone. That's not a problem. So for the copper, they're not really needed for these two right now. But the coal, I mean, that there I could build as well, but do I really want to belt that far? Feels like a, a bit too far. It's like the net from my train line down to the iron. There's other resources closer than that though. Let's the forest ate them. Make my spawn. Let's commence the specification. Yeah, maybe. Um, I can't even get down there, can I? We can. Is it there? Can I go to there? We can. Alright, let's go to. Yeah. Doot doot. I do like trains going through forests, though. Got a nice, nice feel. Let's get the um, Globo. Hey, uh, Globo. Uh, oh. Okay. Um. 
full cargo and that's over there. Okay. Might take a while because this is um well I didn't pick up the power plants, did I? That's the pollution. Very close. I would have got that nest there. This one's kind of out of range still. I don't know how long though. Having a separate base of uh, trains is kind of interesting. I think I have to kill that base. I need to get I need to get back home. Get some ammo. I should repair my turrets. I got a bazillion turrets that are busted. I was going to save them all up for um, when I get robots, but I might as well repair them. Oh, I missed the light. Cool. How does that fit there with the cliff? Quite um, fortunate. All right, let's go back. We can't make it. No path, really. That thing, did I break it there, did I? Oh, because that's a... Yeah, it's because of that light there. Rookie move. Alright, we'll just uh, tell it to go to... Yeah. Yeah, so that was, if that was bypassing that way, it'd be fine, but because I went the other way, it didn't, it didn't work. Sucks with that thing there. Oh. Uh. And that is fine then. Cool. So now we got the coal. We got the plastic. That's the plastic fantastic. Um, we want to do this chem plant thing. I mean, even just doing four chem plants is probably plenty. Mm. around. So you no know, pipes, I could be more aware of what I'm missing. No pipes, no underground pipes. Uh, I need the, I need some iron to make handcraft. Some power plant, because I don't automate power plant. Iron looks, iron looks pretty good though. And you've got some, so we wanted I can show a big solar panel plant down there. But we're gonna know um batteries at this point. Though batteries are just sulfuric acid really. 
and a couple, a couple bits of iron. I guess though the sulfur acid we 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 we'll, we'll be making the sulfur in some base with sulfur acid, and then make batteries, and then make as far more, I'll make it down here. But um, I got those bricks too, don't I? We need them right now. Uh, yeah, that's a bit tidier. Right, I need ammo. That's right, I need ammo. The biggest problem I had. Ammo. Rounds, that's perfect. That's not quite enough. Hang on, I set this to 25. Ah, oh, I turned it off. Ah, uh, we'll go 600. And this does take away that. Oh. Yeah, we got thousands of uh, science sitting here now. What else was missing for my needs? Um, 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 got the power. We could grab some solar if I want to, but I think during the day it won't be burning oil. This cause. I haven't mean, unlocked there by the substation or anything, nah. Still very early days. Oh yeah, pipes! That's right, pipes. I knew there's some big thing I was missing. Pipes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And what miners? Yeah. Belts are fine, everything else is kind of fine. I find it funny now that satisfactory they dumbed the game down so much with those infinite chests. You never had like no inventory management at all. It's like, oh, I feel like building this. So you're more just building a sort of anywhere simulator. It's pretty much a, it's like a visual designer factory. You're like doing a visual de factory. There's factory DF, you got inventory management. It's probably for the better inventory management. Does actually aid in the game in its own little way. Uh Yeah, don't need this sulfur this acid here. This sulfur's no good here. We don't even need that. I'm leaving it here because I don't know what to do with it, but we got plastic and this should be good. I don't know whether the This will be fun or not, but we can um So the right, maybe. You can bypass all this shit. Now, as copper guys, we probably want to send this plastic out to here. The building in that. That nest has got to go. And so is that those three. And that one there. And that one there. Uh, they're not like urgent. There's actually a lot of time. We we I mean, we spend too much time with um fight eradication compared to their actual threat level. All well, because it uh, I guess it saves you time putting a wall though. Putting walls is kind of uh, I think it's kinda of waste of time. You don't need to. Later on you can just use bots and dump down some defenses at last second, that's fine. There's gonna be a long belt though. Plastic. Um 
Yeah, so... Hmm. So this is pull for red chips, right? So we need a green and red chip factory, which is, I think, for red chips. It's plastic and copper, really. A little bit of iron. So the iron's already this belt here, so we could probably build this over here. It's just not going to belt it all the way over. I mean... That copper's dead to me, really. It's going, but then when I... When it dies, this one's have to belt a couple of round, or we're gonna train. You know what I mean? Like, I don't think I want to belt that. We could just keep doing trains. The trains are pretty good. This is a bit unfortunate with this plastic line, though. Gotta be done. Now we could send it straight up from here. Past this. This belt line. And that would make sense too. He's gonna chop through this forest. So I'm gonna wiggle around the outside of it and then wiggle back in, I think. That makes the most sense. I don't even need to chop the trees down really, I can just belt through there. There we go, that's plastic onto the bus. Bit of a long trick. We need a radar down there. <coughs> Whenever the factory planet and then game and editor we can do the prototyping will be updated by the time space age releases. Yeah, some of the mods are I mean, I, I can't like the mouse over on these now though. Some of the mouse overs are quite useful. Wow, I fill these things up with crude. Crazy. Where is he positive power on that? Really? Goodness. That's a couple luck anyway. I think the stone's the problem. We have to get that mine. I really feel I should do a train station for it, but I, I can just belt it. Hello it's such there. a sad belt. Hey Wiz, how you going? I do a belt, we can go. Skill issue. Cross serious. Long belt. Home from work? Oh nice. The plastic's dripping in. I think Stein's fine right now. We've still got... A9K. So let's go get the red chips. Even if it's a sad build of it. I think it's five red chips in the build. Still. Maybe. I should go for my grenades actually. Get these for us a little quicker. Does that new belt go so far to the right and then back left? Where's the belts? So far the right. This one here? Because of the trees. Let's look how dense the forest is. The forest is insane. I like, I like the trees. I don't feel like chopping them all down. They call me a greenie. Uh, copper wire, yeah, that's not bad. Now, if we're doing this red chip just for blue science, it's not so bad, I don't think. It's three advanced circuits. 
Yeah, the trees and stay for now. That's a very it's a very dense forest. Like you can't even see the floor. It's this crazy thickness. The new the new engine's got real crazy trees. I think we put um in here. We're gonna get rid of these trees though. We're gonna pick some grenades up, but I don't think we got any spare. Looks like we got no grenades actually. We got no coal. That's a bit of a worry. Uh, I'm only going to bring that coal belt up. Oh, it's only half loading it though. Hmm. We could make it proper. Give me some more grenades. We can use the excess grenades and the backfill into a uh, storage chest. I think 50 grenades is fine. I don't know if they'll get any because uh, we're seeing much better now. The coal's very really solid now. But the patch itself is not that great. There's still a bit more to go. I haven't really made a massive base, so it's not the end times. I'm out of belts again, really? Oh, I guess I just built a million belts, didn't I? <coughs> I need a drink actually. I need like a choke cough. Just, I'm not sure. I kind of seem to get a lot these days. Yeah, the iron is looking a little bit thin. I don't think we need spare grenades for a while though, if ever, because the... It's 4,000, we might as well stop it at 4,000, I think. That'd be too silly. That's enough of a buffer, I think. So I got no grenades, so I'm gonna chop them myself. Really? This is just for uh, red chips up here. Yeah, this guy must have like robotic arms, eh? I don't think this engineer is a, a, a living being, eh? It's way too strong. enough room to start one. So put it there. That could be the copper wire. Um oh my god. I 
remember the push stick to the other one. One, two, three, four, five. That's the red. I hope that's the same ratio. Is uh, it's what I'm used to using. <coughs> I might use a bigger pole on this. the gap. Um, and then the other one's both sides. Well, I can't remember actually. What's the consumption rate? 0.25, and that was 0.5, so that's kind of, or it needs a, a blue inserter. filter it. Uh, put it left green. No, my god. Hey, quality, man. God, it does my head in. So many times I pushed the wrong button. <laughs> so hard to unlearn that. It's so hard. Um, this is plastic on the other side. Red chips. <coughs> How many days do you office uh, with? What? Oh, Got the wrong button. Most of my work do require me to be in the office at least a few days. Oh, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna bring the um, gas up here, which is kind of a pain. Uh, it's just there, we've got the gas there. We can ship the gas. I guess we ship the gas along here, then up there. It's just a lot of pipes. Um, yeah. I mean, that's fine. It's just, yeah, it's a lot of pipes. Be nice to have blue science going though, so we can, uh, you know, unlock some more things. We've been kind of taking it pretty damn slow. The the, the distance for resources for me is way seems way worse than uh, other people. Things to seed, but this seems like shipment tons of forest as well. I don't use any gas, no. We're at the point where I don't feel like doing manual clicks. I feel like getting robots. I'm like beyond clicking. Clicking chicken. Yeah, I'm trying to store up grenades actually. I told my battery, oh, we're storing them up now. So we're excess grenades. So that coal boost worked out. 
So you got 50 grenades now, so I could actually make a roadway. Um, I think the best bit would be, I was going to chop through here, because there's actually a choke point there of forest, so I can get through there. But I could drive my car through there, for sure. Is this going to look enough gas? It doesn't, does it? So these need, um... Is that... It says 20, but what's that bit? I don't even know. It says 20 gas per second. So 80 gas a second. And this makes... 9 gas a second. Oh man, we're way under. Holy shitter. Okay, so we need eight, eight, nine of these. So in your time zone, I work 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and every other Sunday. Mm. Yeah, I know you work a lot, Wes. That's... How many are we missing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And that will be enough. I love you can ghost those now, which is nice. Maybe enough for a full bit of plastic. I don't need a full bit of plastic. Um, but I will have a full bit of plastic. It's more that I don't think we have the power for this, actually. I don't think my power plant has been sufficiently expanded, because these are quite expensive. But I was going to get efficiency modules going as soon as possible. That'll help me out. And the uh, Gamba modules. Team Gamba, man. Alright. That's my car. Right there. I keep feeling I'm gonna have a drink. Yeah, Auckland time is my time. There's only one time. New Zealand's pretty much up north south straight. Okay, which is the. Man, that looks so dense. Even though it's the thin part, it's so dense. Yeah. Yeah, those are mad hours. Madness. I'm gonna go up through here. Alright. Go the way of trees. Alright. Um, I don't want these to be in the way though, so we're gonna put this. Um <coughs> mm. too much. 
We'll go to right and go up by the um Can I go across there? I think so. I don't really want that there. drive through there at some point. I think we're smoking sulfur and sulfuric acid, eh? Uh, are we? Just sulfur, really. I mean, we can make sulfur here. I don't want to mess with my roads. I'm not going to drive through there, so I might as well go up. Tried at my uh, armor piercing rounds yet. They do 8 plus 4.8. Yeah, okay, they're a lot better. Oh, it's another sulfur finally. I don't know how many sulfurs we need. We do need the water as well, but that's not a big deal. The water is straight south. I can't remember the ratios, to be honest. There's one sulfur. Three of our second two engines. Now, we've already got the engines. I just get to belt those engines I made up here. Now, they were... Yeah, we're just going to send them up over and up. I mean, we could make them again. Uh, we do have steel on this bus, so I could just make them again. It's not a bad build. It's just this... Now I'll do for space. Um, that's iron, isn't it? Iron.
What do I underground here? Yeah, see what fits. Is it long enough? No. Oh, that's all good, isn't it? That's fine. Mr. Tree. Where's the sound gone? Got no sound in the game. Oh, there it's come back again. Well, that's a bit close. Uh, yeah, awkward. Built that bit too close. I, I actually forgot because I hadn't built this thing out. I should have gone further north. Uh, it is just okay. <laughs> Damn. That's a bit silly. Coal in favor on this bus. Definitely the steel. I know the bricks there, but we don't need the bricks, but we can leave them on there. I don't bother filtering them off. I might upgrade them. <coughs> What's the actual ratio on the input on this? Uh, sulfur and engines in the same belt. Okay. Stop is enough for this. We're actually out of belts. Awkward. I don't know. That's not the one to steal from, but it's there, so. Might be enough to get this. Uh... Gone? Ah. Uh. Oh, that should be uh, blue sites finally, jeez. There's a tree in the way. It says 2 a second. This site needs 0 0.03 a second, so I think we're fine. It's 0.06, this site's 0.07, so... It's 42 and... 
that's what you do, that's fine. Uh, 0 0.09 times 7 is 63. 12 fives are 60. So that's the ratio, <coughs> oddly enough. Um, just gotta cook it, cook it onto the bottom end of this. I can move it up. Um, that is fine. Okay, blue science. Knowing it's some fucking like uh, modules and stuff, fine. So I can actually get um, some quality modules. We call them gamma modules. Let's hand graph those, why not? Um, that's my pollution now. It's fine, we're far away from baddies. The train light's working, the train's been there for... I don't know where that's... ...working. I assume it is. I haven't got the radar coverage. Actually, I don't know what radars. That a long time ago. <coughs> um, we could put one random item on the side, or we just go all the way down the bottom here and put one somewhere. I didn't put down the uh, solar panels. Feels wrong putting on it in here. But I could just put it even cheekier as it might in here. It's like an old, old thing. I don't really need it. Um If we don't need 25 of them, maybe like 10. Uh, I want to get like landmines and stuff going though. That's where explosives comes in, so that's sulfur and coal. <coughs> I guess we need coal for very long and make explosives in here and acid in here. Um, I want more than one of these going, I think. Or get acid, but... You can't rotate that, can you? Oh, I thought they were in the flip building, so maybe they gave up on that. Maybe it was too hard. I'm running out of pipes, of course. Might call it though. I was gonna do that. I was gonna try to do three hours, but not enough twice. It's five hours. So that's probably good. Not too late. 
Okay, let's... Isn't that hardness hurting me, dude? We're actually getting the science going. So what's actually important? Um, I think like advanced furnaces, blue chips, I mean, they're all pretty good. Uranium mining could do... Allow, allows the usage of fluid and mining drills. Ah. Ooh. Yeah, I think... I think we've got Kovac, so it's a bit rough. I definitely want these sort of things, so like automated. I need, I need to get red chips actually in my base proper. Normally you grab this thing first though. Um, and then you kind of rush towards rocket. Where is the rocket anyway? Or bots? It's rocket fuel and then rocket silo, right? I can't even see what's before this. Oh, there it is. That is buying bots, interesting. I need lubricant. Electric engines. Bots. Probably the personal report, to be honest. Might me build better. What's my thing? Just blue chips after that. So, not, I wasn't too bad. Like seven and a half hours. Seven hours forty one. Um, this science would, should rip through. If I had blueprints, I could bend down straight away. I would have um, a rocket side in no time. Because the actual like, the main part of the work was actually getting these trains going. And I got coal, oil, and iron ore. And they're kind of the main things, I think. The stone and the copper are no biggie. And the uranium is no biggie. I think there's space here to make an uh, oil process too. A big buffer actually as well. Think about it. I should put down more labs. So I was going to get prod modules going. For my labs. Oh, there's a tree here, really? I need to put down. We might do another row. But we kind of run out of uh, setters. Is it bug on the end there? Yeah, rocket fuel near the 8 hour mark. I mean, I'm pretty happy with that. Now, I can actually make my Majorama now. In my pocket. I mean, I could just grab the red chips and the belt. I don't have enough spear right now. But it seems we could do for some reason. Are we not getting enough motors? There so should be. They seem in the right ratio. Copper does look a bit weak, and so does stone looks very weak, but we're not using bricks. So. Yeah, 
We definitely buff the belts and buff the furnaces to make pasta. Uh, that was actually backed up, which is interesting. With the radar, I do. Let's go put the radar down where I remember. Yeah, I'm gonna get some. Some firepower, I think. Not really, I think, but. Uh, just a bit of fun. Oh, I need to pick up more of those in pipes. This area definitely needs a radar, though, for coverage. See what's going on. And then down south, I need some radar. Oh, and those power plants as well, which I did craft. Where the the train reminds you of uh, that that campaign map. <coughs> That one's already covered. Oh yeah, the um Is that working? That's because it's unbal unbalanced, I see. Let's fix that up. Ah oh. oh my god. Didn't see that. That should uh fix the train. We should go that nest one here as well. We're a bit tougher. Almost crafted my my drama too. Not the best power plant situation, but it's enough to keep that going, I believe. Oh, and the... Yeah, it's all good. I mean, this was a dead end, but it's definitely not. I wipe out this nest here. Coast makes it a little bit tougher. Look from this side over here. They don't medi oh, got medium, so it'll be a little bit tougher. Do have rocket launchers actually? They haven't, uh, Equip them. Shotgun's better though, anyway. Um. Yeah, we got ammo. All right, let's go.
Let's tough that out. Not big worms. Biggies. Not any mediums. Guess the turrets aren't very tanky. Yeah, it's tough. Um, it's because I didn't uh, swap this for there. That's why I mucked up. Made it a bit tougher than it should have been. but not too much. Like 100. No, 50 rounds. That's fine. Cool. That was that was a bit tougher. Uh, worth it though, because, yeah. Um, very close to my pollution cloud. That one there, like, looks... It, it should... Because they'll, they'll colonize, right? So just get them too. Oh, Taurus. Oh, I got the um, Majorama too. Yep. Well, that looks bigger than it was. Very basty. Thank you. Uh, many worms up into my turrets for sure. This need 30 rounds though. Do that. It wasn't too much. But gotta be careful of the, the wormies. There's a spitters up here. Safe as houses now. Eve's train up there is the next one, but that's far away, and then those three. These guys are gonna take a while to colonize. I mean, if I was been really worrisome, I'd build a massive wall, wall to defend the area and all that, but no. Nah. But no. Nah. Uh, well, no. I think a radar down there, but. Think about it though. Why am I not doing radar down there? Don't know. Let's do radar with, with um. Same power source, right? Let's do like. This a radar and then solar panels. Yep. 
keeps it going fine in daytime. One too much actually. Five of them you need. In daytime that'll be fine. Oh, the moth. Okay, moth. I don't want moths in my room. I think I might um, wrap it up for the night though. We almost got to uh, robots. So a bit slow, but I don't know. I think I'm doing alright. It's good for me. Um, I think I went. I spent. I spent way too much time dealing with the biters though. I just got obsessive about them. I found the new train so it's quite quite cool. A lot of things to automate again. That train's much happier now the and so is the plastic actually. We need three more um refineries. I got the new armor, I can actually get um, things on it. I wish I made that a bit wider, but. That'll do. That was fun. Um, I'll probably be back tomorrow. Got raids on. Nice and sweet. We're worried, uh, we're worried Ben Boo. Ben Wu is, um, I think still productivity. I haven't seen that. Looks like he's got productivity science and blue science. There's a bit ahead of me. Got stuff dropping down from the rocket as well. Cool. Anyway, peace. See you later, Wes. See you, Captain True. See you, Valdek. Good luck as... Hopefully we get science. Um, we'll get happy at the rocket side next time. <laughs>